Greetings folks, we're up to part four of the Mackie Jet build. It's now at a stage where I could use it as a sloper. I've got the servos in the tail here. All up weight at the moment is just on one kilogram. Needs a 2003S up in the nose to balance it for slope soaring, which takes it to around uh, 1200 grams, 1 1.2 kilograms, which is not too bad for the size. But because I can't get out sloping at the moment, I'm going to continue on and thought about motor on the tail, motor on the nose. With the motor on the tail, there's no way I can balance it at a reasonable weight. I'd have to put 6,000 worth of uh, battery up in the nose to, to balance it with the uh, motor on the back. So we're going for the motor on the front. I'll chop the nose off here uh, and we're going to have a folding prop on the nose, which will be pretty sympathetic, I think. Uh, so I'll put that little disc of plywood on there and I'll have a cowl uh, which will be coloured up correctly. So it'll be quite discreet really. Uh, it's not going to look too bad at all, I think. Uh, so that's a 2212. I've got a T-Motor 2317 there, but not a folding prop on that one. I'll try it with this one anyway and see how we go. I have some little intakes there just for looks. I'm trying out some wing fences as well, which will also serve to protect the uh, servos under there once I get them right. And they're a sort of a proper scale detail. May even help with anti stall too, who knows? So I think when we're all set up with the motor, it'll be around about 1500 grams, which is pretty good for the size. I think it'll be a fun plane to fly. Going for the motor on the nose because uh, I really want it to be fun to fly, easy to fly and efficient and that's going to give me the, the lightest weight and uh, the best power setup I think rather than uh, twins on the wing I thought of that but uh, it's unnecessary. Folding prop on the nose is what we're going to have. Alright let's finish it off. The Mackie MB326 is pretty well ready to go. I have printed a few little extras like the jet intakes there, the wing fences there. Uh, I have some servo, can we see that? Yep, servo protectors under here because I realised that when it's going to land it's basically landing on the wing. I've also put in a, a kind of a landing wheel here just to keep the uh, wings and, and that up off the ground a little bit uh, when it's coming into land. I've also put this kind of a hand grip there so that I can hand launch it, otherwise it was impossible to hang on to. Made up this canopy here with some uh, 3D printed hoops and some mylar, just tape and uh, mylar. The battery ends up all the way back here to balance it. It's a 4S3000 and the weight comes in just under uh, 1600 grams. There's the motor, uh, folding prop, that's the T-Motor 2317, a nice powerful motor, that's going to give it heaps of grunt. I've done a current run up and it's, uh, it's pulling oh, 35 amps at full bore I think. And I also have my stickers from my friend Paul, uh, so that's what I'm going to do now is put the stickers on and then after that all we have to do is wait for the um, restrictions to go away so we can go out and uh, do a bit of non-essential flying.
Thank you.